Beta compares an investment's historical performance to a benchmark index. The ratio it produces describes the investment's relative risk. If the right data on key variables is available, you can use Excel to calculate beta. Begin by identifying the equity in question and the benchmark index. You will need historical prices. They can be found online. It's best to find a website that lets you download prices in a spreadsheet. The percentage returns for the equity and benchmark must be calculated before the historical data can be plugged into the equations. To do this, take one day's price and subtract the prior day's price, then divide by the prior day's price. If one day's price is listed in cell B4 and the prior day's is in B3, the function looks like this. This returns the percentage as a fraction. Once you have an array of percentages for both, you can calculate beta. One way Excel solves for beta is by using a regression with this formula. Excel presents the arrays as columns of price data. Another method is to find the slope of the linear trend line created by plotting benchmark returns against equity returns. Beta equals the slope of the trend line. 